Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Cat Tells, the alpha version. And we are here with our beautiful little Mossy and her adorable Belle. Look at that. I still love this accessory. I absolutely love that we're able to dress Mossy up a little bit. And that's especially very useful because very soon, tomorrow, in fact, it is going to be the first day of winter. And I imagine it's going to get pretty chilly here. So we definitely want to keep Mossy nice and warm. So one of my goals for today is to hopefully gather up enough muse that we can come on up to Ember's shop and possibly manage to get Mossy another accessory. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. <gasps> the scarf. Oh my gosh, we only need two muse for the scarf. Okay, I thought we needed a lot more muse for the scarf, but I guess we got the bell and it was the most expensive item that uh, was accessory wise at least that was for sale in Ember's shop. So today, my friends, we are going to be preparing for the arrival of winter. We're going to talk with the mayor. We're going to talk with Scout, who's been uh, giving us those private sneaking lessons to hopefully jump up on the prey. We do now have the steady prey active skill, which is very useful for being able to get right into the circles of where the prey- haha! <laughs> Take that! See that damselfly never saw us coming! But those little active uh, hunting circles really help when we are trying to figure out what we need to do in order to catch the prey. So let's see if we can impress Scout once again again today by snagging a nice little mouse. I don't think we happen to have a mouse. Yeah, we don't happen to have a mouse inside of our inventory, unfortunately. So let's see if we can dig one up. Uh, there's a crow. I mean, I don't know what we're gonna hunt in winter, actually. That's gonna be really, oh, there's a mouse. You guys, it's a mouse. Okay, so as you can see, you get, no, I'm so close. Get it, yes, okay, I still managed to get the mouse. So as you can see, you can kind of get an idea of their awareness circles, their spheres of observation. Ah, that mouse got away before the animal will realize you're hunting it and run off. And I'm still learning how to perfect it, but Mossy's making some wonderful progress. Oh, there was a squirrel. <sighs> All right. Eventually we'll figure out that we're about to walk on top of squirrels and mice. Oh, there it is again. Okay, let's wait. Let's wait. We can do this. I think it's a little bit more aware than mice are, but ah, and it got away. Oh, I should have used our charge. Oh, and we're starving. All right, let's go ahead and eat the crow that we caught the other day. And let's take this little mouse over to, um, let's see, how on earth? I know the other day I like figured out by accident how to move things around, but it looks like you can't move the mouse around. It looks like you can move the scallops around though. That's kind of interesting. That's so interesting. So it's like you can move the decoration items around, but you can't move around the items that you actually use. Huh. And you can't click on, okay, okay. That'll be another thing that I can add in as a suggestion to the Cattails forums, which I highly recommend you guys check out. Be aware there's lots of spoilers for things in the alpha, but if you want to provide constructive criticism, suggestions, and a lot of cheerleading to the developer team, then it's awesome to sign up on the forums and do so there. But let's see if we can find where Scout went so we can give him his mouse, his flirty little mouse of the day. Scout, Scout. There's a squirrel. Oh, there's another mouse. Which one do I want to hunt? Uh, let's, oh, dang it. All right, let's hunt this mouse then. Remember its sphere of influence? Gotcha. All right, well, we got a couple of mice and I was totally going to give it to Scout as, there he is, Scout. Oh, um, fancy meeting you here. Just a coincidence, coincidence. What do you think, Scout? Good to see you today. I see lots of cats doing things that they'll be accept, uh, so that they'll be accepted or appreciated by others, but that's not my style. Oh my gosh, that's so ironic. I'm like blushing. He totally just called us out. Did you see that? <laughs> I can't believe that. Here we are running all around him trying to catch a mouse so we can be like, hey, Scout, look at what we got you. And he just called us out on that. Oh my gosh, I am so embarrassed right now. I'm not in it for anybody's approval but my own. Oh my goodness. I, I'm too embarrassed to give him the mouse now. I can't believe he just called us out like that. Okay, we're just gonna have to like live with that for now. And maybe what we'll try doing instead is improving our hunting skill. Maybe that's what he's trying to tell us. Trying to gather up all these mice just so we can give him the gifts and kind of see really seem really, really cool that way is not something that he thinks is cool from us. He wants to see us try to become better hunters for our own sake, not to be able to impress him or anything like that. 
That's both cool and a little bit like of a bummer at the same time, because that's exactly why we were trying so hard to becoming like to become good hunters. Uh, we can't even romance him yet because it's the alpha and not the beta version. We can't even have kits, so sigh. At least the mayor appreciates our mice. So let's go ahead and talk to the mayor. Hello again. I'm rather busy, but we can chat for a bit if you'd like. I am sorry if I'm distant today. There's just a lot on my mind. Well, I will admit, Mayor, I can't blame you because it is the arrival of winter, and I understand that that's going to be quite a little bit of a threat onto the entire colony. So let's go ahead and give him a mouse so that he feels a little bit better. How did you know that I love these? Thank you so much. This is a great gift, Mossy, and I truly appreciate it. There you go, Mayor. Well, I hope you have a wonderful day. We should probably go ahead and start storing up. <laughs> Look at our abundant prey pile. You can tell that I care about making sure Mossy is fed through the winter as compared to our gigantic stash of, you know, the, the little scallops. <laughs> so, <laughs> all right, well, let's go ahead and put down some of the treasures that we've got. We can at least, I, you know what? I'm gonna eat that mouse. What else do we have? Let's get down here to the shells. And we'll drop the shells really quickly. And I do have something exciting to share with you guys that I actually learned. Thank you very much. A lot of you have been telling me this tip for a while now, but I try to like not get too many spoilers. Like I don't wanna know which cat appreciates what type of gift without stumbling on it myself first. I did the same thing in Stardew Valley, of course. Uh, so don't, don't take it personally. Look at our cool little collection of seashells. I think Mossy would just roll around in this for ages. But I did learn a special way for how we can sell the goods that we bring up from the mine to the mole so I finally know how to bring mr. mole things like these iron ores and these topaz and get his little mole coins in response so hmm you know what? I'm gonna leave the iron ore and the topaz for now because we're probably gonna have plenty of time to actually spend lots of time digging around in the mines in the future considering winter is about to be here we probably should focus on actually doing some hunting today instead because I don't know what the weather is gonna be like once the seasons change I don't think there's just gonna be prey running abundant under our paws all right so let's go ahead and see where's the fighting very interesting the fighting is really far away today one is over at the delta where the battle is raging and one is up at tomb creek so i think we're going to come over to this woodland corner and we're going to go ahead and use our diplomacy aka our spying skills and have mossy kind of control the area so let's go use our spying skills casually step in over here Dun 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 dun! Look at that! If only I had some lavender! Man, and too bad there's not gonna be any lavender available in winter. Then we could eradicate the rest of the influence that the mountain cat colony has in this area. I'm not gonna let them stick around here. This is gonna be- I really wish we could jump up on that little log. That would be really fun. Alright, let's see. Any prey? I don't see any fish ah oh, see and there was a mouse there was a whole mouse and i missed it all right let's see if we can find a good pocket of prey there's a whole bunch of blackberries better grab those because those probably aren't going to be available in the future let's see here's forest east which is 100 percent controlled by us right now oh there's that little bunny now this bunny has really good ah no I was gonna say has really good radius for noticing us. Oh, here we go. And, ah, uh, dang it. All right, maybe I can just like slow down. I need to learn how to use that to learn how to study the prey. Oh, 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 oh. No, go, 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 go. Get it. Go, Musty. Oh, we were so close. I'm still not a very good hunter. See, this is what this is what he was telling us. He's not impressed by people who just run around trying to do the bare minimum so that they can impress others. He wants us to learn to hunt so we can be excellent hunters for ourselves. Oh dear. For our own sake. Which is probably important because at this rate we're going to starve to death. Alright, ooh, look at all this. Nice. Ooh, and there's a little chipmunk hanging out by this blackberry bush. Don't my- Ah, dang it. That was a squirrel even. I keep calling them chipmunks because they look literally like the chipmunks that you can always find in our backyard. Uh, back home in Michigan. And here's a cat named Rat. My whiskers are going crazy today. Stop twitching already. Oh my gosh. Nice to meet you, Rat. I love how they always have something fun and random to say. Let's see, any prey over here? I can't believe we've hardly caught any- Ah, oh, and I chased away the only mouse in the area. I love these trees, they're very, very pretty. Oh, there's a squirrel, okay. 
Got sneak, 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 sneak. Ah, I got over eager. Ah, I got so excited to see that squirrel that I totally chased it away. All right. Well, I think what I would really love to see once we get to the higher hunting levels is that scent compass so that we'll be able to follow the scents. Kind of reminds me of Wolf Quest, that idea. But follow the scents of where the different animals are. Wait for it. Oh, I was so close. Ah, and I just like threw myself right into the next area. All right. Uh, I'm so sorry, Mossy. I have not really helped you be a very good hunter today. I'm so nervous about winter, to be completely honest. Maybe we should just run around and try to gather up the last of the plants. At least I can manage that much, and then maybe we can, like, upgrade her hunting skill as a result. We do pretty well. Oh, there's a fish. Can I get that fish? Is it going to come close enough? Can the fish notice me? Ah, see, and I messed up her hunting again. That's totally on me. I just, I'm not very good with the controls. All right, let's keep moving. No fish over here. Ooh, this is a nice big bush to be able to rattle, though. All right, and let's wiggle up here. Oh, there's a little squirrel. Let's get him. Oh, so close. Wait, I can chase him. Chase him. Ah, oh, he found a tree. I was going to chase him into a corner and then get him. All right, and we probably want to go ahead and curl up in our den. So let's return home. I still feel like that sound makes me think that the cat needs to grow like helicopter wings and just like go go gadget their way home. And let's go to sleep and we're going to welcome our very first day of winter. <gasps> oh my gosh! What? Oh my gosh, look and you can see her little breath. Ah, we're starving to death. Oh my goodness. Oh, we have a lot of rabbits. Thank goodness. All right, let's go ahead and eat the rabbit. And I'm going to eat these blackberries. And we've got quite a bit of prey on us, actually, which is a good thing. But probably should have worked harder on my prey pile now that, now that I see how chilly it is. But this is so exciting, guys. Oh my gosh. It's winter. It's our very first winter here in the wild. And we've got quite the awesome den. Look at this. I feel like our den is totally tripped out for, for the season. It's like decorating a Christmas tree or something. All right, we'll put all of these pieces right over there. In the future, I'll be sure to organize my dens a little bit more carefully. Let's see, all of this over here. My hunger is doing okay for now. Lots of adorable blackberries there. We have tons of blackberries. All right, now I've got a little mouse. I'm gonna have to be very careful. I, I need to wait, especially now that Scout has kind of made it clear that he doesn't care. <laughs> he doesn't really seem to care about what we do. Um, what we do in giving him gifts. I, I almost feel like in a in a sideways way, he's rejected us. So we'll just have to wait on that. Jeez, I love the music in winter. This is so charming. All right, and we have a couple damselflies. Normally nothing to write home about, but I guess we're not gonna see these, these little dragonflies for quite some time. So it might be fun to hold on to them. Again, it'd be really fun if you had like random cats who offered views in exchange for random items every day. That would be a fun way to like rely on your little collections. Let's come talk to the mayor and see what he thinks about this winter. Hello again. I'm rather busy, but we can chat for a bit if you'd like. Look how pretty the snowfall, the snowfall is. So he loves winter too. The sky shares its beauty with us today. We could all learn a thing or two from its generosity. Mayor, that is so poetic. I'm so glad you're enjoying it. But look at this, guys! Our very first winter! Let's come over and make sure that we have Mossy prepared for the winter by selling a couple more Mews. I think uh, we'll go ahead and sell one of the golden seals because we only need two more Mews. Oops, sorry about that, Ember. There we go. And then let's go ahead and make sure that Mossy is ready by getting her little scarf. I am so excited. These accessories on the cats are literally one of my favorite things about the game so far, which is silly, but it's just like it's collectible and you can kind of show it off. All those elements come together to make a very enjoyable experience. So let's go ahead and we'll grab the red scarf, possibly uh, hinting at the fact there might be some other kinds of scarfs that we could wear in the future. And I think we're, we want that rather than the sweater because the scarf is more our thing. So we spent a ton of our muse just then, but I think it was worth it. And we go ahead into our accessories and look at her little scarf guys oh my gosh it's so cute mossy you're totally ready for the season this is gonna be awesome well all right so now what we need to do is we are going to start exploring and searching around is it is it iced over 
Guys, it's iced over. Oh my goodness. And what is this? Winter berries. Whoa. Did we slide? That's so cool. I don't think we slid. It just kind of felt like we did. But we have some winter berries now. Bright blue berries that grow in the cold months. A tasty treat. Oh good, so we won't immediately starve to death. But it may be a lot harder to find prey now. So, oh, like, there's a mouse. So, at least we have mice. That's a good thing. Did I get it? Yes, all right. So maybe we'll be just fine after all. There's still mice to eat. There's winter berries to collect. There's a little scarf on our little neck now. So we're really, really quite adorable. And we're leaving little footsteps in the snow behind us. <gasps> That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm quite in love with that. All right, so next time we're going to explore. Ooh, I wish I had, uh, let's just, there we go. Use that diplomacy skill. Now we have taken over this territory, keeping it nice and firmly under our control. Very happy about that. But next time, we will continue to explore and see the mysteries of winter and how it differs from the other seasons. And in the future, perhaps even next time, I will have to show you guys how to sell items to the mole, which I finally remembered how to do. So, I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye!